Hey, how's it? This is a foundation coming at you with a pretty quick video. I um, hope it's not too long. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I haven't made videos in a while. Um, I'm on a project right now. I'm renovating my place. Um, and then I have someone in my life, and she, I believe that she, you know, or not believe, she's she's my number one right now and all that. Um, so as much as I love to talk about the Cowboys, you know, hey, bro, you gotta. You know, you gotta keep those things in perspective and all that. I mean, I I talk about the Cowboys all the time. It's just the video is not gonna be as much. Um, but anyway, and so thank you for those who shout my videos out, who who likes my videos, who watch my videos and all that. Thank you guys all, and I, I hope I can keep continue to keep on doing this and all that. Um. So anyway, let's go on with the video. Um. You know. The Jason Garrett fire, you know, bro, you guys heard me after a while, you know, like, I was done with Jason Garrett after the 2000, you know, 2018 game, the Monday night game against the Titans, where I went, I went to that game, and, you know, it pissed, it pissed me off, you know, like, I was done already, um, but then it shows, you know, what, what, what pisses me off more is that, technically, I mean, you know, it's, it's our sixth coach now we're going on ever since our last Super Bowl victory, but a lot of us view Barry Switzer as our as as, as Jimmy's team, the the, play, the players was Jimmy's players and all that. So 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 you know, technically we're on our seventh our seventh coach. I mean, you got Barry Switzer, you got Chan Gailey, um, you got Dave Campbell, you got um, Bill Parcells, you got Wade Phillips, and then you got Jason Garrett, and now we got Mike McCarthy. And you know, and basically the Mike McCarthy hire. Um, you know, I wasn't overly excited, and but I was, at the same time I wasn't pissed or dis disappointed, because um, th this is like like I just said, it's a reflection on on Jerry Jones, and basically we know that Jerry, Jim, uh, that Jerry, Jason Garrett's flaw flaws was is that we could not have a consistent play in our team. You know, not only this back to back years, but you know this one week to the next or one drive to the next, we didn't know what to expect from this. From 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 this Jason Garrett team and all that. Um, so basically, what 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 Mike McCarthy is saying is that what the Jerry, Jerry Jones is saying about Mike McCarthy, he's gonna make he's gonna make us a consistent team. He's gonna make use the maximization of of Z. You know, not just running the ball, not giving him 25 yeah, exactly. touches a game, you know, and, and all that, I mean, you know, just making sure that, hey, we, we're using this guy in everything that we can to, 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 to squeeze out every talent that he has and all that, you know, same thing with Amari Cooper, um, you know, Michael Gallup and all that, Dak Prescott, you know, using him to his full potential and all that, and then, and then you, then, then to infuse the thing that the other thing is like, yes, you know, Jason Garrett, he's a, you know, Jason Whitten, he's a legend and all that. But you saw painfully how much more better Blake John was playing and all that. Even though he wasn't a better blocker, he, it was it was a thing like where, you know, and, and I've, I've, I've used that uh, that argument, like the reason why they have Jason Whitten there is because he's a better blocker. But then this is where it's like, we came to the point like, okay. But he's not helping really, you know, like, you know, it's not like we're a dominant, dominant run team and all, you know, the way, I mean, the way the things was doing that. But with, with Blake Jarwin, it's like, bro, when, when he was on the field, he was making plays. He made, he made huge plays and all that. And to, to find a way to, I mean, he, you know, do we draft another tight end this year? Do we, do we keep him as, as a role player? Do, does Dalton Schultz? Have a chance to 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 show more, but Blake Jarwin is showing that he can be a weapon and all that. But to get him to to that area, like man, we have so much talent, we don't know what to do with. Bruh, no way, bro. You you have always some use and all that. Like how much we screaming about about Tony Pollard? You know, not just being a relief for Z, but use him in different ways to 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 maximize his you know full potential. And to and to maximize what you the, the overall talent you have on the field, like and Zeke and and Paul is on the field. I mean, it was just like, wow, they're doing something nice. They're doing something, you know. Oh, look, they, they have Zeke and 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 Paul is on the field. But you was just like, you know, kind of like was like, okay, how can creative this really be? And you know, Mike McCarthy. They say basically Michael McCarthy can get everybody involved in that sense.
So that's what I'm looking for. Um, well, I make. Um, there's a ton of free agents, but you know, I probably will do a quick video of, of who I who I would mind resigning and and who I'll just say, you know what, just let them go and all that. But anyway, that's my video. Mahalo for watching. Paniola boys, who you with? You know who I'm with. I'm with the Dallas Cowboys. Well, we know that the bonus.